Hey, I'm Alex Branning, and you are watching a Branning Group Productions video. We are here to help you launch profitable marketing campaigns, find new revenue streams, and even coach you so you can do it yourself. Schedule a call with me today, alexbranning.com slash call. Hey, my name is Alex Branning, and I've been working with FreeUp for uh, a little over a year now. I want to show you how I use Trello to manage my FreeUp team so they can work along with me and uh, my local team. So this is my Trello board, an inside look at everything we have going on and all the different ways that I inter interact with my team. Um, so we have two freelancers. One is Angel, who you'll see. Um, so we have the weekly tasks to be repeated and the podcast ready to schedule. Angel has been on our team the longest. She was initially brought on to help out with our podcast. And now she also helps us with some other tasks that we do on a weekly basis. So, and then we have Femme, who is our new uh, free up freelancer. Uh, she works with us every single day. She's amazing. And so um, I'm going to show you exactly how we have everything set up and the different ways that we communicate with both freelancers um, to, to represent their strengths and their tasks. So first, let me just show you the general layout of Trello. We have uh, Joanna, who is also, she's on our local team. <clears throat> And so uh, Joanna has her tasks that she has set out. Um, and then uh, she has a Trello board <clears throat> where she posts the questions that she gets. So that's that. For, um, for Angel, <clears throat> she has her weekly tasks here. And these go up and down. And inside of the, the task, we list out the URL for her to complete the job, um, the login credentials, the Google Sheet that is shared with the client. We have a tutorial video that we make. So with every task, Myself or Ryan, my assistant, makes a tutorial video, an over-the-shoulder demonstration showing how to do the exact task that we want them to do. There's, we can explain it, but it just it works so much better when you can also show them exactly what it is that you're doing. So we have two different, um, two different videos here. One is a video showing how to use the tool, and the other one is showing how to do the task because there's an element of this task that requires her to be on the phone. So we've done that. And then we attach the login credentials for Groove, which is our customer support system where we send out emails to our clients and then we get incoming support tickets. So she has access to Groove. She can interact with this client, George, um, as she's sending and receiving leads and working on finding the best quality for him. And then inside of this card, Angel works with myself and Ryan, giving us updates, sharing questions, ideas, etc. Now for the podcast, it's very similar. Um, and we've, she's been working on the podcast with us for over a year now. So we've got the process really dialed in. So when it's ready for angel, what we do within the Trello card is we have a due date. So notice here, the due date, Monday, July 15th, she knows that that's when this particular podcast needs to be launched. Um, then we have the attachments. So, uh, here's her checklist. So here's Ryan's checklist of all the stuff that he does and here's angels. And so, She's editing the transcription to make a blog post. Um, we don't need to attach the login credentials on this card anymore because she's already got it. She's been working with us for a while now. Then she inserts the jingle into the podcast. So she does some auto editing for us. Then she uploads it to Libsyn, which broadcasts it out everywhere, and then YouTube. Um, and then she follows through by creating the blog post on our website, posting it on LinkedIn, and adding the new podcast menu uh, or the new podcast episode to the menu on our website. So she has a checklist. This has been in just an amazing um, uh, upgrade for us, for our communication with Angel, showing her step-by-step -step what needs to happen, making sure she has all of the elements on the page and the attachments, and then giving her a due date. Once she has all that, we have found that it's been just great to work with her and, and she's able to understand exactly what we're looking for. So with Angel, she's been on the team for a while now. The two tasks that I showed you are things that she does week in and week out uh, for the past year. Now, Fem is new. And so for Fem, what we've done is very similar, but we've done some tweaks once we have uh, learned how to work with her. So she, she shared some feedback with us and we made adjustments. So one of the things that we did is actually add a due date on the card. And so this way she can see exactly when things are due. So for this one, posting of the Instagram stories for us, she did that last week, nailed it, we're done. So I can archive that card, she doesn't have to worry about it anymore. Here's the Instagram stories for the week of July 8th. 
and we put the start date for her to do that. Then we have adding end screens to YouTube videos. So these are things that she's doing for us on a regular basis. Again, here's a video tutorial. Here are two images that correlate with the task that we're asking her to do. And then we can go back and forth with questions, updates, etc., as she performs the task. So again, for us, the video tutorial is an over-the-shoulder demonstration of us doing the task the right way so she can see exactly what we're doing. And then we share with her inside of the Trello card what the next steps are. So this is how we use Trello to talk with our free up team. We use a combination of checklists inside of cards. So again, here's one here. We have a checklist. Um, we have due dates. We use the attachments feature and we do over the shoulder video demonstrations with Fem. She likes us to attach the due date um, on the card so that she can see it as she scrolls down to see what is important, what is time sensitive for Angel. She's been doing this every single week. So, uh, we don't we don't use the the due date feature and there's just we, we we talk with her just a little bit differently based on the need. So this is how the branding group uses Trello to communicate with our three free up freelancers. We love them. They do a fantastic job for us. They're a part of the team, a part of the branding group family. And I recommend using free up. Hey, what's up? I'm Alex Branding. Thank you so much for watching my video. I've got a link to the resources that I mentioned right below. If you click in the description, there's a link right there on the top. I would love to hop on a call with you. Go to alexbranding.com slash call and pick an open time slot on my calendar that works for you. I'm excited to chat with you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll talk to you soon.